How's it going guys? It's Flint here. I'm pretty excited today because we got ourselves a sniper rifle gerbil shooter. That's right, you can see it here. It's all nice and packed in its box. We're going to be doing an unboxing of it today. We've got a new camera um, that we're filming with now so you can look forward to better quality videos. Let's go ahead and take a look over this box. So it's claiming of course over 15 meters. Average gerbil shooter hits the 18 meter mark which is 60 feet. It does come in a green color as well. I'm pretty sure this is the black one. There's an accessory list which tells you everything that's included. Flipping it over, there you can see the green one. Um, its total length is 77.5 meters, so just over three quarters of a meter. They're calling it the SWAT Pioneer sniper rifle, and this is battery operated. Carry handle on top. Without further ado, let's open it up. Oh, it looks like we have a second box. Oh, it's a bit of tug of war getting that box out of the uh, big box. Another nice little box here. Wow, these are quite fun to uh, you know unbox. Okay, so this is considerably smaller than I thought it would be. That's because the box is packaged like this. That's a bit sneaky. So uh, first we'll look in the white box. Oh, very nice. Some foam darts. A heap of ammo there. Safety glasses battery, charging lead, scope, and ammo container. Oh, very nice, put that to the side. Now let's get this blaster out. Okay, let's see how straightforward this is. Ah, it looks like there's a gap in here that this lines up like that. Oh. Oh, that's locked in there nicely. Okay, and we've got a tripod. And then our scope, of course. Well, there we go, fully assembled. Oh, I've got to flip that round so the legs fold forward. There we go. Okay, nice. So where shall we start from? Uh, we've got the back of the gun. Here's the butt. Now this is where the battery goes in. So it'll connect in here. Then we've got, I think this is just like a cheek rest for your cheek to rest against. But of course the stock is quite short so you're probably not gonna use this bit. Then you've got the handle here which is a silver color. Trigger which is red on top. Got your scope, you pull that out, we can get a disco going here. Lovely, lovely. So that's where your ammo goes in there. And you can turn the light on while you're shooting. Uh, it's up to you if you wanna have a disco at the same time, why not, you know. Bipod at the front, flips down like so, and locks into place quite well, actually. Falls back forward like that. You've got like a grill here where you can kind of like see through this front part of the barrel. And then you've got the long, barrel here with the big red tip on the end. So there it is guys, um, I'm gonna charge the battery and prepare the ammo. I'll film a video shortly of the range test and get that out to you guys soon. Anyways, thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you in the next video.